what's up y'all so we are going to vlog this weekend it's valentine's weekend please excuse me i look a mess i'm about to go to a few stores um it's supposed to get bad as far as like an ice storm out here in texas <laughs> so i'm about to go to the to walmart first i gotta stop and get some gas um and then i'm going to go to walmart to get some household supplies and i need to get a bag to put chris's gift in for y'all that do not know uh tomorrow today is february the 6th no what's today's day y'all today's february 13th saturday tomorrow is february the 14th which is sunday valentine's day and chris birthday is on the 18th which is four days after valentine's day so he has been wanting this drone y'all so uh i bought that so i'm about to go i gotta go to walmart to get a household supplies first of all like cleaning supplies and then i'm gonna get a bag while i'm in there to put his gift in um and then after i do that i'm going to um go to best buy to actually get the gift i'm gonna do drive up and i gotta go to dollar tree and get something so yeah my face is ashy because i just brushed my teeth so disregard i look crazy I'm vlogging on my phone because I'm about to go out. Um, I just don't, I'm not at the point where I feel comfortable carrying a camera in the store. I just, <laughs> I'm not comfortable. But yeah, I look a mess. I don't have no earrings on. I don't have no contacts in. My nose is red because it's cold out here. Like, it's freezing. This morning when I woke up, it was 20 degrees. And right now it says it's 25 degrees. I'm sitting here letting my car heat up. It's taking so long because it's so cold. Um yeah i used to park in the garage but uh i got here before chris so i just parked out here and he parked in the garage so he's moving right now so i can go well yesterday we went to mini golf um let me move uh oh i cut the car off what am i doing uh yesterday we went to mini golf and they had bowling and stuff um uh, i didn't pull my phone out Cause you know, you just be in the moment and stuff. But yeah, we're gonna be vlogging this Valentine's weekend, which is super duper exciting because we have stuff planned. Uh, we can't really do too much because um, like I said, the weather is supposed to get bad starting tomorrow. So that's why I'm gonna go ahead and, um, I'm gonna go ahead and go out and get all of this stuff that we need because the weather is supposed to be so bad. It was, I don't know if y'all heard, but it was a really, really bad wreck here in Dallas. Uh, I appreciate those that called and checked on us, but we are fine. We were not involved. It was a 100 car pileup on the highway. Um, the roads were icy. It involved semi trucks. It involved cars, SUVs, and a few people died. Um, and a lot of people had to be transported to the hospital. So, yeah, it was really, really bad because the roads were really icy. You know, in Texas, they drive like bat out of hell. And it was just really, really bad because a lot of people, you know, thought there was it. Because, you know, when stuff, when the weatherman says something's going to happen in Texas, Texas is like bipolar. Like right now, it's 20 something degrees. Tomorrow, it could be um tomorrow it could be 70 degrees like so people don't really take stuff serious i i'm not gonna lie i don't because when they say it's gonna be a certain way you know the next day is the total opposite so i guess that what that's what happened and it was really early in the morning uh, my job was about to close and everything um a lot of people did not come to work it was only like seven of us that actually showed up. I live next door to my job, so I have no choice. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I'm about to stop at the gas station first. And then I'm going to go to Walmart, like I said, to get some cleaning supplies and to get a bag for Chris's gift. I'm looking here, but the thing is here. So, disregard. Let me turn my phone this way, see if it. No, I don't like that. So yeah, um, we're, I'm gonna do that. And then I gotta go to Best Buy, that's the last thing I gotta do. And then tonight, well today we have, me and Chris are simple people. We don't, on Valentine's Day, it's just another day. Like we celebrate our love every day. We don't have to wait till Valentine's Day to celebrate our love. So we, I said, I don't wanna 
go nowhere fancy. Let's just go to Cheesecake Factory. We both love Cheesecake Factory. Let's go to Cheesecake Factory. So, at, we have reservations at 345 at the Cheesecake Factory because they are the one out here by our house is always packed. Always. We The closest one to us is in Frisco, Texas because um, we live in Plano. So, this one is always packed. So, we just put, went ahead and booked the slot so we can make, guarantee that we didn't have to wait long. Like, they sometimes be on two-hour waits. So, we just booked the reservation to make sure we didn't have to wait long. And then after that, we probably go bowling tonight. I really want to go bowling. We did a little bit of mini bowling yesterday at the little mini golf place, but I want to really, really bowl. I have not been bowling in a while. And this is what we want to do for Valentine's Day. We don't want to do anything extravagant because his, his aunt and his grandma is coming to town this weekend to see him for his birthday. So I'm pretty sure we're going to be doing stuff with them as well. So, yeah. Yeah, we don't we're not the type of people who have to celebrate Valentine's Day and go to these five star restaurants. We don't need these five star steak restaurants. We don't even like steak. <laughs> we don't like steak. I don't like steak. Chris don't like steak. So yeah, we're just gonna do what we do. So I'm about to pop my gas really quick. I'll be right back. <sighs> Alright, y'all, I'm back. I wish I had something like I prop my phone up, but I don't have I have a um I have a um tripod for my camera but I don't have anything for my phone so hold on let me put y'all it's so cold out there like I literally was pumping my gas for probably not even um not even five not even two minutes and I am frozen like for real what's my lip gloss man I don't have my lip gloss. I got this bliss sticks. And my lips look ashy. So, do y'all ever, when y'all pump y'all gas, <laughs> do y'all ever lock your car door while you're pumping? I do. What I have to do is, I um, because when I lock my car door, it also locks my gas pump. Like, not my gas pump, my uh, tank, my, like, door. So, if I lock my car door, I, from the outside, I can't access my tank i have to unlock my door and then open my tank and then lock the door so what i do is when i get out i open my tank first before i even put my card in i open my tank first and then i lock my car door because i just feel like <laughs> i watched too much lifetime y'all so i just feel like if i um got my back turned anybody could just hop into my car while i'm pumping my gas then i get in boom they're gonna knock me upside my head so i just make sure i lock my car door I hope everybody does that. Like, not even the fact that I don't watch Lifetime movies. I just hope everybody does that. So, I am now on the way to Walmart. I'm going to Walmart first. Like, I don't want to go to Best Buy and then have to leave this stuff in my car. I need to go to At Home and get another rug. We have... Um, we got a white rug, like it's like fluffy, like for under our center cons under our coffee table in the living room, like by the couch and stuff. But it's like it's not dirty, but it's not white anymore. And we don't wear shoes in the house. Like we take our shoes off at the door, and Ace is on it sometimes. But Ace is not a dirty dog, so it's not white anymore. You know how white is hard to keep white, so. I don't know. I'm going to have to get I'm going to have to get another rug for that area. I think I want um you know, Chris don't care. Whatever I want, he's fine with it. So, as far as decor wise, he don't care. Um and I think I want like a gray like a light gray with a mixture of white specks or whatever to make it um you know. Like, you know, like a really light gray. I think I'm going to do that. But I need to go to at home. I just passed it, but I'm not going today. Like, because I can't carry no rug to the tr truck by myself. Uh, Chris has to be with me. He's at home. So, yeah. I got to redo my hair as well. I'm just going to redo the back. Um, so, I can make it tighter. I'm just going to redo the back. The front is fine. I just slapped some edge control or whatever on it. 
Oh, y'all, yesterday, let me show y'all. Hold on, because these people can't drive. It's Texas, they can't drive. Baby, they can't drive. Baby, they can't drive. Let me see if I can show y'all. So, I'm passing. Where is it? It's a drive through daiquiri place right here on the corner. I don't know if you can see the drive through right there. Y'all, I got a daiquiri yesterday called South Beach. It's basically like a, if you've been on a cruise, you know what a Miami Vice is. It's basically like that. It, that Not basically, it is that. It's a pina colada and strawberry daiquiri. It was so good. And I think I'm gonna go back. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna go back today or tomorrow. I don't know. They give you the little um, mason jars to go with the daiquiri in it. And it was only $9. It was so good. So I'm probably go back and get that. And it's down the street from my house. So yeah, it was good. I might just get the white Russian next time. So come on. So I'm at Walmart. I'm gonna take y'all in Walmart with me. So y'all can help me pick out Chris's birthday gift bag. Yeah. He's gonna be so excited, y'all. He been wanting this drone for I don't know how long. So Valentine's Day tomorrow. His birthday is on Thursday. What, yeah, when's the 18th? Yeah, his birthday is on Thursday. So I'm trying to debate if I want to give it to him for Valentine's Day or just give it to him on his birthday. Because technically it's a birthday gift, but it's a birthday slash Valentine's Day gift since it's so dang on expensive. Walmart is packed. Babe, I just need some cleaning supplies. Honey. I mean, they is packed like sardines. Sardines. They packed like sardines. And it's so cold, I don't want to park too far. Oh, here go one right here. Oh, here go two. Come on. Yay. Around with me, y'all going to always get a good parking spot. <laughs> yes, I got to redo my hair. It's like a mess. That's okay. We're going to get our life together. We're going to get our life together. So, I'm going to go ahead and park. And we're going to go into Walmart to get some cleaning supplies. Oh, child. Where's my mask, honey? Y'all see, look, I'm so sick of COVID. Gotta keep remembering to put this mask on. At work, I just be walking around with no mask. My boss be like, Tia, where's your mask? I'm like, oh, girl, I forget. <laughs> girl, I forget. Y'all see this mask I got? It's Cardi B. I got it from uh, <laughs> Amazon. I'm not advertising her at all because she ain't paying me. It's um, it's the, from the video. She's like, coronavirus. <laughs> but okay, let's go in Walmart. People be thinking this is Molly Cyrus. Dang, I left my headset. I left my out my uh AirPods. Healthy and strong. Not Walmart playing uh forever, forever, my lady. So we got a couple things to get. Let me get a basket. Get a basket. I just basket. Oh, 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 Everybody in here look a mess. So I ain't feeling no talk boy.
Okay. We need some more cascade pot, bro. I get you. How did I miss? <laughs> this is not two. Hey, I'm not, I spent four years at college station. I know I can get the two, but this ain't two. You gotta understand where she's coming from. <laughs> you gotta just in case. Yes, just in case. Yeah, it's like the Gilligan's Island. One hour. So I got these. Yeah. Skirt baddies. Because the kind I usually get, they don't have it. I'm gonna see the kind I usually get. I'm out of everything lately. Um, this is where the picture is. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay, so I think, yeah, I'm gonna just get these skirt baddies. They don't have the kind that I normally get. That's fine. And then I need some garbage disposal. I need these. I need these, but I don't see where they're at. I'm gonna just grab these. They were just sitting back there. I mean, that's fine, I guess. It's more of those. And then we need another scrubber. Alright, so now we need, let's see. Mm -mm -mm. We have surface cleaner, but we need some stuff for the tub. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Uh, oh no, we don't have pasta. I'm not just picking up stuff, y'all. I already knew what I needed. So we got some 409, got some uh, Lysol wipes, Pine Sol, uh, some Clorox. I need some Comet. Got some scrubbers for the kitchen, garbage disposal, um, balls, whatever you call them. Soap thing, dispenser for the kitchen. Some um, dishwasher pods. And now I need some Comet. Oh wait, okay, so now let's put this back and we're gonna get some actual kaboom. That's what we're gonna get. Kaboom, I can see kaboom down here. I prefer kaboom. Okay, let's see. We're gonna get the kaboom spray. This stuff is bomb. Okay, we're gonna get Lysol, scrub and bubbles, clean and fresh. Thanks for this. And there's some comment.
y'all. I think that's it. And then I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna look um, for Chris a bag for his gift. I think that's all I need. get some oxyclean um stain remover it says free versatile safe on colors okay i'm gonna just get this from the one that says safe on colors they buy 65 dollars this is just specified that it's safe on colors I think we got everything we need, so I'm gonna uh, talk to y'all when I get over to where the bags and stuff is. Uh, I need to look at my phone and my list because I feel like I'm missing something, so I'll talk to y'all when I'm done. <laughs> Alright, y'all, so I came over here before I went to the other section because I need some, um, some uh, I need some paprika. Oh, they got some paprika. There's only one can there. Okay, I'm gonna get this. This is a jinx when I walk over here. <laughs> I don't even be over here by no pimples. Try to get me away. Don't get me wrong, I do want kids, but it's like I just really enjoy my freedom. I'm not saying that you're attracted to the kids, it's just I come and go as I please right now. I sleep as I please right now. And you can't do that with kids. If you want to leave, you got to either put a ring with you or find someone for them to go. You wake up when they wake up. Can't do it. Where would the gift bag be? Oh, over here. Okay. Let's see, y'all. Um, Thing. I don't know how big the box is. Okay, let's see. Maybe that one right there, or this one. Or that one. that one looks childish. Uh, yeah, let's say party time. Mm -mm. I think I'm just get this one. It's say happy birthday. Plain and simple. I never like to get the one in the front though. Yeah. I look on the other aisle. If I see something else, I get that one. But now I'm just gonna grab this one. This is cute. But I don't know how big the box is. So I'm gonna just get that one to be on the safe side. Check out what all this stuff. That's okay, I know that they get So I am back in the car. Um I'm on my way. I got all the household supplies and stuff. Um I'm on the way. You can tell this bridge had ice on it, child. That's crazy. 
but um, I'm on the way to what am I trying to say? I'm losing my train of thought because I'm trying. I'm watching these people. Like it's it's ice on the road and stuff. So I'm watching these people. But I'm on the way to Dollar Tree. Um, it's a specific seasoning salt that I get from Dollar Tree, y'all. It's bomb. Like bomb. Like you only need a little bit. I don't like when I got introduced to this. My mom found it and she was using it. And I haven't went back ever since. Um, I don't even use Larry's. Larry's, however you say, it. I don't use that. So, but Walmart was packed. The Walmart by our house that we go to, they turned into a self serve. So they have no cashiers like they don't have cashiers they have all self checkouts and it's really nice like it's set up really nice it sounds bad but it's not they have so many registers so many checkout self checkout registers so it's not like you use you, you just walk up to one and you just check out and they have of course you know like four to five staff members that are standing there if you need their help but um are you gonna go because if you don't go i'm gonna go it was your turn Anyways, four to five uh, members that are at the self checkout there to help you. If you, you know, if it goes off and we won't let you bypass something or whatever, but they don't have the cash registers anymore. I don't know if it's because of COVID, um, but when we f originally started going there, um, they were already remodeling, but COVID was already around. So I don't know if they're doing this because of COVID or if they're, they were doing that anyway. You know, I, but I, I think it's because of COVID. Because I, I don't know what Walmart has all self-checkout. Like, they have they don't have not one cash register. It's all self-checkout. So, and like I said, I keep looking here because my face is here. But the camera is actually here, so disregard. <laughs> but after I leave here, I'm going to go to Best Buy and pick up his gift. Um, and then... After that, I'm gonna go back home. We have our reservation at three, it's one o'clock. So we have about two hours. I gotta redo my hair, so that's more than enough time. The reservation's at 345, so yeah. But today is, it, I feel like today would have been nice if it wasn't so cold. Like it's not gloomy or anything. Like the clouds are out, the birds are flying. You can see the blue skies. It's just no sun anywhere to be found. Like the sun is like hiding behind the clouds you can see the sun but it's not bright enough to warm us up so but um and these folks in texas baby they don't believe in giving you your space when you drive and they be all on your butt i feel like if i can't see your headlights then you too close to me and that's just on period period you too close So I didn't talk to y'all about my new job. I don't know if I've talked to y'all, but I have a new job. I know I'm no longer a 911 dispatcher. And honestly, I can say I'm so grateful and I'm so blessed that I was able to be, you know, provided with this job during a pandemic. And I like it. I really like it. And it's like not, I don't want to jinx anything because I am in the honeymoon phase with this job. You know how you first start a job and you like it for so long and after so long they start to do stuff to make you mad and you just be ready to move on and find another job let's hope this is not that because i really like this place i like the company the job is so simple it's so easy um the pay is really well and it's literally next door to my house y'all that's the catch the catch is it's next door i gotta be at work at nine i don't have to wake up until eight not get ready at eight i don't have to wake up until eight long as i'm gone from the house by 8 45 because yeah i keep in mind i gotta i gotta get myself situated once i get there i gotta get to my desk gotta log in gotta clock in all that stuff so as long as i leave the house by 8 45 i make it to work around like 8 49 8 47 depending on if it's two literally two lights if both of the lights are green i'll get there in two minutes it's lit. I can walk to work and I, I just I love it so um so as long as I leave the house by 8 45 I'll be clocked in by like nine o'clock 
sometimes I clock I be I clock in five minutes early because I live that close to work so I like it I really do I like it it's a really good company they have really good you know they have really good benefits and it's it's a really good company I like it and I see myself being here for a while but like I said it, you know we're in a honeymoon phase and it's like that with a lot of jobs when you first start but I was y'all the story about 911 if you I'm not gonna say it's not for everybody but it's not for me you know I can't speak for everybody but I just know it was not for me I could not continue to um, do that to myself physically mentally and emotionally it was not the the calls it was not that hold on y'all let me park right let me, let me get my life together so but I can still talk to y'all okay yeah so it was not the calls at all that bothered me it was um it was the job and the shift in the hours itself it, it wasn't it wasn't the calls. so the calls didn't bother me it was the job management um the hours i just could not do it i could not it was too much it was way too much for me so that was that and i just had to go I, I was not happy where i was at and i just refused to work at a location or at a job where i was not happy so but yeah i'm about to run into dollar tree uh tj maxx is next door So I don't know if I wanna. TJ Maxx is next door. Why she just park her here and move? <laughs> when people do that, I feel like they just hit somebody's car. She literally parked and then left. Like that's so weird. Like she has plenty of space. I don't. I don't understand. But I'm gonna go run to Dollar Tree. TJ Maxx is next door. Uh, I'm tempted to go in there, but I'm not gonna go in now. I'm not going there. Let me run here and get this seasoning, then I'll come back out and, and pick y'all back up. I might not pick y'all back up until. Well, I'll pick y'all back up and show y'all Chris's gift. And then I won't talk to y'all until I get back to the house. All right, y'all. So, I am now at Best Buy. Um, I'll show y'all. Well, I can't show y'all the seasoning salt. It's in the back. Um, I was going to say I could show y'all the seasoning salt that I was bragging about for, for um, from Dollar Tree. So, yeah, I got to go redo my hair. I might need to redo the top too, but I don't feel like it. I'm going to just put some gel right here. It's just white because of the edge control. But that's okay. I'll fix it. So, um, yeah, I'll just, I'm at Best Buy waiting on my order. Uh, waiting on Chris's um, birthday present to come out. <laughs> and I'm going to show y'all what it is when I get it. So. But yeah, so the other day uh, when I said a lot of people from work called out, I had no reason to because I live next door. But also, I'm trying to say my PTO. We got trips coming up. Uh, we're going to Universal Studios in a few weeks for Chris's birthday. We're going March the 18th through the 23rd, I think. We're leaving on a Thursday. We come back on that Monday. So whatever dates those are. I know we leave on the 18th. I don't know what that Monday's date is. I think it's the 23rd. Um, so yeah. And then after that, we have to go back home um, to look at the venue for the wedding. Um, yeah. Did I tell y'all we got engaged? I don't think I've talked to y'all. Oh my God. I'm so sorry. I've been neglecting you guys. Y'all, we got engaged. Yes. We got engaged. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. So, we he did it when we went home. Uh, we went home in November. It wasn't necessarily for... Well, I guess you could say it was for my birthday. We, we went home in November. Uh, but we went the week before... 
I think we went the. I don't remember what week that was. It was the week before Thanksgiving. So yeah, we left on my. We left like a day or so after my birthday, a day or two after my birthday, um, and we went to his grandma's house. It was on a Saturday. He told me that it was a party. They told me it was a party for his grandma. <laughs> It was like a small little get together. I thought it was a get together for her birthday because her birthday is around Thanksgiving. So I thought it was a get together for that. And I walk in and it's for me. I had no clue. Y'all know I'm an FBI agent. I found out everything. But that they they did they did very, very well with that. I had no clue. Everybody was there. My mom, my sister, um, my godmom, a couple of my friends, his friends. I had no clue. His family. I had no idea and it's like they <laughs> I kind of feel like they were talking about it right in front of me and I still had no clue because we went to El Baton the night before and we went to the it's a Mexican restaurant in our hometown called El Baton that we went to and uh, they were like yeah because we're gonna we're gonna go to the party we're gonna get ready for the party and I'm like what party y'all talking about <laughs> the whole time they were talking about the the surprising proposal party so yeah it was so cute. It was cute. And of course I say yes. Duh. <laughs> That's my best friend. Why would I not say yes to him? So uh yeah, so we have to go home, look at the venue. Uh me and my mom's been looking at dresses and stuff. So we have to go home, look at the venue, and then um what else? I kinda want I, we might go look at some dresses while we are there. Um, but it's a bridal shop over here by my house that I have not been to yet that I might go check out. We've checked out probably like two places so far, but I didn't like anything that I saw in there. Like my vision for a wedding dress, it's like, I feel like it has to be customized. I really do. Cause what I want, I don't, I don't think it's going to be found in stores, but yeah. So we're going to get, I'm going to get all cute and zolled up tonight. Why is he driving so fast? Like a maniac. I'm confused. This quality is fire. I'm vlogging on my phone. I think I already told y'all that. Uh, and I have a 11 Pro Max. I have a 11 Pro Max. And it's showing everything. Uh, where is my order? Like, I know they busy, but can y'all designate somebody for pickup orders only? Like, it's so many cars out here. So what I'll do, I'll call y'all back. I said call y'all back. I am tripping. I will get back on here once they bring his gift out. Because I don't know how long it's going to be. So I'm about to get on TikTok. Okay, so I'm back home. Chris is in the other room. I'm going to show y'all what he got for his birthday. I was going to say Christmas. He want to see it, but he's not going to see it until it's time. So I'm gonna put this on the prop you a little bit. Let's see. Ooh. I'm gonna try to prop this on some lotion. Okay. Can you see it here? Huh? Freeze. Okay, Chris. I'll see you don't hear me now. I'm sorry, I'm taking it back. Okay, so this is what it is. Let's go say hello. I'm gonna get his reaction when he open. When they do say here we get Tell us up. What's going on? <laughs> so 
Say hi, Ace. Say hi, baby. Say hello. <coughs> no? Okay, I guess not. Or maybe that was his way of saying hey. I guess it was a hey. So, I'm about to redo my hair. And then, what time should we leave here? I'm gonna just redo the back. What time is it? Yeah, I got time. I'm just redo the back. Get Kirk, get Zun up. What you eating? I mean, what you wearing? <laughs> what you eating? What you wearing? Mm -hmm. I don't know either. I don't know. I think I'm, it's too cold to be trying to get cute. Or some sweats or something. I ain't, I ain't got to, we ain't got to be cute. We've done the fancy dates before. We'll have to do it just because it's Valentine's Day. We do them anyway. But let me open these blinds, get some sunshine. I need to go get some curtains. That's what we need to do. Get some sunshine. Hold on. Open them some more. Open these two. Hold on. Oh. Hold on, this one's tweaking. What's happening right now? Okay. I guess this is how it's supposed to be. Okay, this is like a dumb. Okay, whatever. We'll leave it out of Ooh, it's, it's the sun coming out. It's getting pretty out. So we're at the Cheesecake Factory. Birthday week. Get it popping. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing. You're gonna be how old? You're gonna be an old man. 24. 25. No. You're gonna be 24. You had me second guess for a minute. So I ordered the orange chicken. I hope it's good. Because I've never had it. What did I get last time I came here? I think I got the chicken Alfredo. Yep. Yeah. Chris got um, the um, Philly cheesesteak with some wings to go. It's crowded in here. We had reservations. I'm glad we did because it is crowded in here. I redid my hair, the back of my hair. They need like they need like like what you were saying. Hold on, let me take this purse off. Take this purse off. This is weighing me down. I got this little cute person chin. Yeah. So they need, I feel like they need a shuttle right here, like you were saying, to block us off. <laughs> like you were saying, you saying it, right? They might need to be the first one to do it. To invent it, yeah. Give us privacy over here. Yeah, to give people privacy. I think we should have got an appetizer. Because I'm hungry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to get the appetizers for now? Okay, right. Yeah, we're going to get the appetizers for now. Well, I ain't got much to say. Just cut it back on. Oh, look. I got this from uh, Miss A. It's cute, ain't it? It's not even the two. It's the one. And it just goes up like this. It looks like I got multiple pieces, but I don't. Cute, huh? So, I'll come back when the food comes. So, I got the orange chicken with the rice and Got, ooh, Billy, on Shabbat bread with the fries. Yep, so we gonna dig in. It look good. Want some more orange chicken? 
so I gotta set up. We back at the house. Got us some daiquiri. This vlog probably about to go ahead and end. And we'll pick back up tomorrow. But let me show y'all the daiquiris that we got from this drive through daiquiri place. So good. Well, this is a new flavor um, that I got. Chris got the, um, the, um, South Beach, like I said, what I was telling y'all earlier, this is the drive through place that I was showing y'all. It's so bomb. Hold on, let me get a good light. Yeah, I have lights all over my kitchen, so it's like hard to. Okay, whatever. <laughs> so, this is the, the like the Miami Vice, it's called South Beach. Got pina colada and strawberry daiquiri. And then the one that I got. I got that one yesterday, but I got a different one today. This is the white Russian. It's called the Bellagio. So it's just white Russian. And it looks so good. They seal it. And then it's in a little cute little plastic mason jar. But yes. So we're going to do that. We have a movie that we're watching. Watch. What's the name of the movie? Uh, Judas and the Black Messiah. Judas and the Black Messiah. I'm sure y'all done heard of that. But we are going to watch that at 7. I told Chris he has to be in the theater, a.k.a. in the living room at 7. Because the movie is going to start. He's going to miss the previews. <laughs> and we're going to drink our deck grease and call it a night. So we will talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye. Say bye. You look cute. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> So this is what I woke up to. It's early. I couldn't sleep because he was making noises. So it's like, yes, she was. It's like seven. What time is it? Seven. It's seven o'clock. So I woke up to that. It says for Tia from Fiance. And then this is his birthday gift. So this is his birthday slash Valentine. It's really his birthday gift, but he going to get it today. Because on his birthday, I got to go to work. I'll be back, but I got to go to work. And then it snowed, y'all. It snowed in Texas and it's stuck. That's new. Okay, so we're gonna open our gifts and I'm gonna get Chris's reaction to his gift. Can you open? You wanna open mine first? Uh, or you wanna open yours first? Okay. You gotta be enough. You gotta turn it the other way because I can't flip my phone while oh. I was recording. Open the card first. Oh, it's so big. I'm gonna turn the big card like this. It says Happy Valentine's Day. Ugly. I can't even believe that. Happy Valentine's Day. Okay. I'm gonna cut some more light off. I'm just gonna cut this one on back here. Come on here. It says, I only want to imagine my life with you in it. You're everything to me. Happy Valentine's Day to my love. And then you wrote, I love you like no other. Will you be my Valentine? Of course! <laughs> <laughs> this is so cute. Where can I put it? This is a big car. I've never had a big car like this. I'm going to put this like this. My face all in the camera. Supposed to be. Oh, that's cute. Got some chocolates. I get my braces off in two weeks, so I'm for the eagle. Sorry. Oh, you got me. <laughs> Y'all, I can't cook rice to save my life, and I've been wanting a rice cooker, and I got a rice cooker. <laughs> Thank you, babe. A Chick fil A card. You're so sweet. <laughs> I'm really excited about this rice cooker. When you get older, you get excited about stuff like this. Dang. I can't cook rice to save my life. Now I can cook rice with my meals. She can cook everything else, but she can't, can't cook rice. I can't cook no white rice. I can't. It always comes out bad. Thank you. I can't wait to eat that chocolate. That don't be made in my desk. It's work. That's my gift time. Give it to me. Big 24. Her.
Hold on, wait. Okay. You can open it. Read the thing first. Read what thing? This. Read this first. Oh, we got loud. Just up. read it. Have a Valentine's Day. Two. <laughs> you deserve it. Happy birthday. Go we'll send it. Open it and see. It's heavy. Open it. Wait. <laughs> Happy birthday. Bruh. Ain't that what you wanted? <laughs> That's what, you so wanted. Litty. That's what you wanted, right? Yes. <laughs> Bruh, I'm finna fight that hoe today. Are you? <laughs> today it's snowing outside. So what that be? He been wanting this. How long you been wanting this thing? About two years. Oh my god, he been talking about. He be like, I want this or a tattoo. I'm like, I'm not paying for no tattoo. That's something you can get on your own. You need some scissors. I ain't gonna lie, I'm probably gonna play with this too. That's why I bought it. Right. Nah, Cause it mine. look fun. It's a drone, so. No, show them. We gotta show them. Oh, we gotta show them. Yes, yeah, sir. They DJ out, baby. I'm probably gonna play with it too. Don't if it die or something. It, it come well before it die. It return back home. Mm -hmm. And it's the fly more bomb. It's the big boy. It's the. Oh, we got three batteries. Ooh. You gotta buy an SD card and buy that. Oh, this I has a two card. year. This got a two year protection package on it. Yeah. So if something happens to you, just take it back to Best Buy. Cool. Hey, say happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. Hey, oh, he didn't get anything. Let me give you. A, let me give you your toy. Get your new toy. Toy. Yeah. He didn't tote this one up. This one gone. He ain't even had this a month. Uh. He, yeah, he didn't tote this up. <laughs> like the squeaker in the middle. He didn't tote this up. Ace, this is your Valentine's Day gift. He got so many toys. I wasn't buying him nothing. This is a new one. I haven't even took the tag off of it. Uh, it's, I think it's a toy inside of here. Yeah. I don't know what this is. What is this? The wet dog mud mask. Oh, it's like a. Can you throw the mud It's like a um, a spa thing. If I if I give you this, how, no, look. If I give you this, I'm gonna have to throw your other ones away. Them away, please. They so dirty. Look, he just will not. He is so excited about it. Let me take tag off. Take tag off. Let me take tag off. One second. There. I'm gonna throw this one away because it's shedding. And then Chris want me to throw the candy cane away, but I don't think I should throw the candy cane away. It's not that bad. You're right. All right, I'm just throw it away. All right, he gonna he gonna cry about it, but he be right. He got that new one. He don't care. Babes, thank you for my rice cooker. <laughs> Hold on, what you trying to say? You agreeing that I can't cook rice? It's only white rice. Yeah, you see, you see, it don't just cook rice. You can throw anything in it. Oh, I can cook anything in No, look on the side right here. It's a grain cooker too. Whatever type of grains and shit, soup. I can cook grain. beans, soups, pasta. Oh. I should have I need a rice cooker. I need a rice cooker. How do you cook, work it? Like, do you just put it on a timer? But do you put it like on a timer? Oh, it comes with a spatula and a measuring cup. Cool. My meal is gonna be fire. Even more fire. Like when I cook stuff like a roast, I gotta like either go get some from my mama, some rice, tell her to cook it, or I don't know. Sometimes I, sometimes it come out right, sometimes it don't. A lot of times it don't come out right. You like your Valentine's Day gift? Yeah, him like it. 
Yes, she did. <clears throat> I know you like your gift. I don't know how it works. I just, I just bought it. This is a sturdy pack that it come in. I mean, like a um, storage. Don't look. Hey. You don't get mad. Well, what are we doing today? Well, we snow in. We can't go nowhere. Well, we're not snowed in, but it's like ice on the road. So it's the ice plus the snow and nobody's driving on top of it. So it's not going away. So we probably stuck in the house today. So probably not going to do anything. But Ace, stop it. Stop it. Let it go. We probably not going to do nothing but um, play, play, play board games, watch a couple movies. We got food. We got food here, so we don't have to go nowhere. We got plenty of food. You can maybe go outside and fly that. You know, go play with the snow. You know, do something. Practice, cause you need to get practice before you try to drop, uh, fly that thing far. But you ain't having where you can fly far. Exactly. That one can fly far. This bun killing me. Anyways, we're gonna end the vlog here. Like I said, now that I have a new job, I can start vlogging more. I can start vlogging more. And I feel you more comfortable to... vlogging on my phone compared to taking my big camera. I can maybe vlog at home with the actual camera until I get comfortable taking it outside. But we're going to leave. We're going to go. We're going to leave and go outside and play with this drone. So, say bye. Peace. See y'all later. Say bye, Ace. No? Okay. I guess not.